hi there once again welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial we're going to learn how we can create a color splash effect in photoshop so this is what we're going to get at the end of the day we should be able to target just the winner within this picture the race you just want to target the winner here and then we'll try to gray off the rest of the images so this is the original image you can see every image here is colored as so once we are done we should be getting something like this we want to just focus on this particular individual within this race so let's jump into action and see how to do this first of all i'm actually going to delete this the effect i applied so we have our original image and then we are going to work on it i believe by now you know how to bring image to photoshop so let's jump into action and see how to do this now before we apply this effect that's the color splash effect we have to make a duplicate of this there are several ways you can make a duplicate of this image you can just press ctrl j on your keyboard to get a copy or you can also drag this down here on the new layer then you get additional copy so whatever works for you just go ahead so let me delete one of these images and then i'll focus on this so i made a duplicate of this so now i have two images and what we're going to do is that we'll go to the image menu and then go to what adjustment and i'll go to the hue saturation the saturation over here we are going to drop it all the way to saturation towards minus 100 click ok now we have everything great off so what i'm going to do is i'm going to apply layer max to this particular image in order to do this we actually going to go to the layer go to layer max and then click on reveal all so we can see we've applied some layer max to this now we're going to use the brush to target just the image we want to actually apply this color splash effect so i want to focus on this particular image just paint on this image and reveal the main color and then leave the rest out in order to do this i'll go to my tools panel and then make sure i'm using my brush to select your brush to make sure you're using the solid to make sure the hardness is what 100 percent for the size you can adjust it the way you want to now if you come here the full background color the dark is actually going to reveal and then the white will conceal so what is going to happen is that if i start painting on this you can see it's going to reveal the color for me if i change this to white it's actually going to hide this color so we actually want to reveal the color of this main athlete the first person in the race so we can zoom in on this you can use the zoom to zoom in on this and then we start painting on this with what our brush so we can zoom in try to increase the size of your brush you can use the square bracket that's the right to increase and then left to reduce it so start painting on this individual remember this is our target we want to just reveal this if you get extra spaces just forget about that you can easily hide them using the white for background color i'll reduce my brush in order to get this perfectly done all the same you use zoom in on this image in order to do a perfect work you are using the brush and then just pay it around the images where you want to actually reveal so just do that we paint on that if the brush is too big just try to reduce the size in order to get your work perfectly done remember to subscribe to this your first time visiting my channel and don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials so we just target main image that we want to actually reveal then we just paint on part of this image that we want to reveal i can just screw around and then just paint on that part of this image and this is actually going to take just some few minutes you can take your time in order to do that i want to conceal hide certain part of this image this is not part of the main image so i can paint those parts and then what hide them I just want to hide those parts since they are not part of the image I want to reveal so you can just paint on those parts we'll just switch this back to the dark background and then we we'll continue painting just paint on the rails just paint on the rest of the images you want to actually reveal the extra spaces will come back and then fix them out okay, so we'll just try this all around this image where we want to reveal and then we continue to do that
so I'm almost done with this and I'll just play around it once I'm done places that are first posed that I don't want to and just follow the same process and then hide them so let me just go ahead and my brush seems to be too big over here so just reduce the size of the brush when you need to do that in order to get a perfect work done so i have extra spaces exposed which i don't want so i'll just switch the full background color and then i just want to conceal I just want to hide those parts just by painting on them because i don't want to expose those parts of this image so just go ahead and then just paint around those places And there we go so you can see we've been able to work to use the color splash effect to achieve this and then now you can see we have just the main image actually focus on that's the at least leading the race we're going to use the effect if i turn this off you can see this the initial image and then we've been able to create something like this like subscribe for more of my like subscribe for more of my youtube video tutorials and don't forget to turn on post notification so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials till i come here again bye bye